Hi guys, this is Abhi from Gokche DB, and in this video, you're going to learn how to deploy an EC2 instance using a CloudFormation stack in AWS. Let's get into it. Let's start by navigating to the CloudFormation service, then click on Create Stack dropdown with New Resources. Select Template is ready, and for template source, I'm going to choose Upload a Template File. This YAML file defines a resource called Web Server Instance, which is of the type of AWS EC2 instance. Let's look at the properties now. For Availability Zone, I'm specifying US East 1A, and for IAM Instance Profile, I'm specifying Amazon SSM Full Access. To grab the image ID, Attention! let's head to the EC2 dashboard. Click on Launch Instance, then scroll down to the AMI section. Here, you can pick an AMI and grab the corresponding AMI ID. Just be careful Company halt! and ensure that you are in the same availability zone that you specified in your YAML template. To get the Security Group ID, Scroll down to the network settings and grab a security group ID of an existing security group. Here, I picked the default security group. Instance type can be found in the instance type section. And for tags, I'm specifying a key of environment and a value of prod. Let's head back to the cloud formation window and upload this template file, then hit next. Give your stack a name, then click on Next. For stack failure options, I'm going to select Roll Back All Stack Resources and leave everything else to default. Hit Next, then click on the Submit button. If you look at your stack status, it should now be in Create in Progress state. Give it a few minutes, for your stack to complete, then the status should change to create underscore complete. Yeah, 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 yeah. Navigate to the resources tab and click on the physical ID of your EC2 instance. Here we can confirm that our EC2 instance is of the type t2.micro and it's running in the availability zone of US East 1A. Head to the security tab and confirm that the IAM instance profile is Amazon SSM Full Access. If you navigate to the Tags tab, you'll see that the Environment tag was set to a value of prod, as expected. Now say we wanted Attention! to update our EC2 instance and add a new tag with a key of name and a value of My Awesome Web Server. To do that, we're going to add the key value pair in the tag section in our template file. Save this file, then head back to the cloud formation window and click on update. Choose replace current template, then click on upload a template file. Select the updated YAML file, then hit next. I'm going to leave everything else to the default setting, then click on submit. Give it a few minutes for your stack status to change to update underscore complete, then head back to the EC2 dashboard. Navigate to the Tags tab to confirm that you see the new key value pair. There you have it. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell. Until next time.